went to the bank and picked up a box of nickels. So let's go ahead, open it up. Not all uncirculated, which is good. And nothing is standing out. So let's go ahead and start on the first roll. Second roll, we have a 1948. Let's see what the mint mark is. No mint mark. 48 plane. And nothing else. So. On to our third roll. We're getting close to 20 rolls in, and there's a buffalo. It's gonna be our first of the year. Let's see what it is. I don't think we are gonna see what it is actually. Yeah, that is very worn, and it appears that someone already tried to figure out the date at one point. There's a black spot right there, big scratch on the head, and I can't tell if there's a mint mark or not. But that is cool. That's a, a buffalo. And that looks like all there is going to be in that roll. So pretty cool. On to the next. All right, a couple rolls later. And we have our first silver coin of the year. It's going to be a war nickel. There's a Philadelphia mint mark. 1943. So 1943 P silver war nickel. Just a couple rolls after that buffalo too. And there were a few that looked like they were a little bit older. In here, 64, 61, and 64. Cool, so let's see what's in the next one. A couple rolls later, here is another 48. 1948, oh, dropped it. Plane, so put that one with our other 48 plane. 59, and that's going to be it. So, on to the next. Alright, we're at the just over halfway point, and here is a 1940. 1940 Denver. Our third oldie, a silver and a buffalo. That one's pretty torn up. 61, 70, nothing else, so... On to our next. All right, a few rolls later, and we have a 41 and a 39. 41 plane makes four, and a 39 plane will make five. Pretty cool. 64, 72, 62. All right, on to our next. Okay, we got 12 rolls left, and this one I already took out. And I just saw it. We had a 41, 1941. No mint mark makes six. And not looking like there's anything else in this pile, so we're going to get into this next roll. Seven rolls left, and here's another 1941. No mint mark. So that is our seventh. And I haven't really been seeing many 60s or 50s, only a few. So, pretty surprising to get a buffalo silver and this amount so far. So, let's see if we can find anything else cool in these last couple rolls. Alright, just finished the box, so let's go over what we found. We had seven old Jeffersons, 41, 41, 39, 41, 40, a 48, and a 48. So, all pretty close together. A 1943 Philadelphia Silver War Nickel, and a no-date Buffalo. So we're going to have to try to get the date off this. I know what it looks like that someone already has, so we'll see if we can do a better job at that. Pretty cool. So thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.